right, here we go. One day recovery and back at it. Gonna do some hypers. I like these to warm up almost every time now. Here's my favorite, I don't know, 40 pounds on and do a couple sets of 10. Gets the heart pumping. And then off to paw squats. And for warm ups on these, I did empty bar up to 95, 135. And then into my working sets up to 175 for four. And decent pauses, I'm happy with those. I can live with that. When I get to the bottom of these, I always try to slow down my count. And then I watch it on video, it's like, man, that's too fast. So maybe I better do three in my head instead of doing two. But yeah, no, it was good. Good set. Good, uh, good pause. I like it. Good and deep. And let's move on to press. See what happens. So I had my squat shoes on for the squats, of course. And by the way, the Achilles is feeling much better. Still a little sore once in a while, but it, it's definitely 90% better. And switched them out for the flat shoes for the presses. And worked up to 110 for five. And lots of warm-ups again. And this is about where I should be. So I'm happy with that. No, no big gains today, that's all right. And let's look at some rows. Rose off the blocks as per usual, which is what I do. And went great. Felt nice and strong. Didn't feel sore from my uh, day before yesterday at all from doing whatever I was doing, so that's a good that's a good thing. But this is a moderate stress week, so we're gonna have a lot more stress next week. So there's no reason to push, just I try to keep my numbers in the green, so I'm about where I should be and not jumping for any huge gains because that should come over the process not over the day you take what you can get on the day and I even did some pull-ups three sets of three doing one accessory at the end of every workout now and that's it 27 minutes of cardio not bad see you next one